Could use a fucking beer. You said it. It's 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 not inappropriate. It's it's another one of your fucking disasters. That's what it is. It, First you take a hostage, against my advice, and then you start some kind of crazy high school romance with her? Are you nuts? She's... She's a 60-year-old housewife! Ow, she's 57! And she thinks that I'm mature. Yeah, well, let me tell you something. 30 years of marriage to the world's angriest mob boss oh. would make anyone insane. You're not making my situation any easier. Oh, there's a surprise. I knew it would become about you. I miss my family. Oh, you're full of shit. All you ever did was ignore them, and now that they're gone, you miss them. Fucking incredible. I'll tell you what's incredible. Fucking incredible. Hey! You mother... Hey! What? Enough! You got me out here. You wrote me into your crazy world of bullshit. If it was lies, new age shit, and arguments about how good life used to be, I could have stayed my ass in Los Santos. Hello, Franklin. What's up? All right. Here's the shot. We're going to Palato Bay, and we're gonna do this thing. Any questions, comments? Yeah. I miss Brad. That crazy motherfucker was with us now. He would have loved this. Instead, he's gotta enjoy himself molesting white-collar criminals in a federal penitentiary. Thanks for sharing. Anybody else? What about me? You'll be waiting for them by the river, handling the getaway. All right. Now, these three go in, you grab the tape. <laughs> They rendezvous with you, and you get out of there. Is that a uh, work for everyone? Great, let's go. Come on, we got a score to take. You ever hit a bank before, Franklin? Yeah, I was the driver on the job my boy Lamar pulled. Guess it's the same kind of shit we doing now, right? Nice, bro. What was the take? Shit, I don't know, man. I can't remember. Come on. Everyone remembers their first score. Uh, shit, not me. Huh? Mikey, bro, what was your first bank score? 88, outskirts of Carcer City. Took a small franchise for 10G. Yeah, things were easier back then. Yeah. 25 years ago. Jesus! Jeff, will you tell these gentlemen about your first job? T, man. You could just as easily. You tell them. I'll do a sanity check. Trevor, the ultimate judge of sanity. Well, it was uh, part of the interview process, I guess is how you'd call it. Trevor knew I could cook, wanted to see if I could handle myself. This cash for gold guy comes through town. Stood the reason he had funds. Next thing, we're burying him and his bodyguard in the junkyard. Well. Most of them, anyhow. 50K. He did fine. He's better at all aspects of the job now, from killing to dismemberment. Hey, your turn to share, kid. I told you I don't remember the details, man. Leave him alone, Trevor. This is an important moment, Michael. Here we are, on our way to almost certain death. 
bonding, pouring our hearts out, and this guy is sitting here soaking it up and giving nothing in return. Hey, if he don't remember, if he don't remember, I'm supposed to trust this man with my life and he don't trust me with the details of his first bank job? Well, how about you? Why don't you share with the group? I'm here, I'll back the facts. The check's cash place? I went in, took him for eight grand, walked out. Yeah. It was a bit more complicated than that, though, wasn't it, T? Maybe I knew the guy. Maybe he ID'd me. Maybe you did six months. Maybe I was out in four, and that children is why we don't leave witnesses. That children is why you don't rob people that you know. <laughs> yeah. Franklin, share. Yeah, come on, kid. It can't be worse than Trevor's. All right, man, shit. Okay. The score was like two stacks, man. 2G? Take home on your first gig? Fuck, that ain't bad, man. Man, the whole score was two stacks. Only I didn't see none of that shit. Die pack went off, homie. Money was useless then. Die pack? <laughs> you amateur! I knew I shouldn't have told you shit. Hey, Franklin, we all gotta start somewhere. Last time I tell your ass something. Ow, oh, come on. <laughs> Don't be so cold, man. Learn to laugh at yourself. You're in danger of turning into this man. Who, me? Yeah, you. Wouldn't laugh, wouldn't hang out. All right, Frank, we're gonna drop you up here, okay? When you hear it kick off, get ready, because we're gonna wanna go ASAP. I'm gonna get away, man. I'll do it. All right, you know where you gotta be? I got it down. I'll bring a die pack just for you! We ready for this? I could use a restroom break. And risk getting ID'd. You're an idiot. Y'all ready? Let's go! Is this happening? This won't take a minute. Get down on the floor! Today's going one of two ways, friends. Everyone on the floor, now. You and you, out from behind the counter. That's it, hands in the air. M, keep an eye on our trusted employee. Okay. Just sit this you got out. You the crowd. should be here soon, so keep an eye out. Doors ready to pop. Come kick it in, Down, M. down. Ever meet this alarm guy? Fucking shoot him. Dude, not if I get to him first. Yeah. Stay back! We got hostages! Tell the sheriff the 211 is confirmed. We're gonna need everything we got down here. <laughs> Sheriff's here. We never could have beaten that response. There's other ways of beating it. Move it! Call up procedure! I don't care if they surrender. I'm killing me some bad guys. Now let the hostages go, and uh, we'll talk like gentlemen. Time to face the music. Sweet mother of shit.
go. Move. I got you covered. Hey, there's cops in the bay. We ain't gonna be able to get out this way. You hear that, guys? Shit. We aren't getting out on the water. Too late for white flags. We gotta find a way out. I'm moving. We're not going through this. Not with 50 pounds of gear. Blast it. Move it, Fatso! We're bringing down the fences here, real and emotional. is a pool with a burning helicopter in it. Hope you got some more of them! The troops are here! It's like second skin. We'll get through it! Keep pushing! Looks like we've run into it. Perfect! It's too heavy! You want to play dead? We won't be playing! Hey, hey! Through here! Right along! on us! This is it, man. You okay? I ain't dead yet. I'm on my way. Man, I'm sorry, fool. Hey, man, these guys are every fucking weird. We out of the way. Out of the way. Oh, 
More army showing up! Hey, we got a train to catch! Shit cakes! They're all over! Cross! Come on! Come on! Come on! This way! Through the warehouse! Stay behind me, kid! I got the armor! I should've worn a suit, man! Use me as cover, Frank! You don't want to get out front! Kid! You still alive? Give me some cover! Team, uh, come in! I'm trying to hold these guys! Where are you? We ducked into a chicken factory to get away from the tanks! Chicken factory? Oh, I see it! I'm trying to head off anyone. Looks like they're going in! You holding on, Em? There's even more of these bastards! Paychecks no good when you're dead, you ass! So I guess we're shooting our way out of here! Close them down! Just fuck off already! Hey man, these guys are every fucking weird! Ah, it was going so sweet! Who else will be fucking this up? Hold them down! Last call! Could be our only way out of here! How you doing back there, Frank? There's a ground team on the way to the factory. I might be able to get the drop on them. All right, you do what you can do, Chef. I'm glad you got hired for the job. There's some guys trying to get in here. Chef's holding them off. Might give us the window we need to jump a train. Hey, let's get that train. I think they think there's more than one of me. They're pulling back. OK. Hey, slip out of town and call Lester for instruction. I got news. You're a waste of the Trevor Phillips ink, my friend. Chef, find us a break, people. Let's get our train. Let's hop the train. Come on! Here we go. Right here. Get on. Let's go. Yo. Easy, easy. I'm a friendly. Agent Sanchez. Our very own corrupt G-man in training. You gotta be careful, buddy, all right? Because they are uh, looking around these trains for illegals. And if you're mistaken, you'll be shot, amigo. Very amusing. Yeah, if you're expecting them two to bring you up, you're gonna be disappointed, homie. Right back at you. Got the money? Everything we got. Okay, and here's your cut. Considering present scrutiny on public worker remuneration, this is a big win. Oh, yeah, that's a huge fucking win. Woo! Monsters. I'm out. Agent Haynes will get in touch with you once Operation Save the Worlds ago. Get your crew together, okay? <laughs> fucking punk. All right. We should probably split up. They're gonna be looking for a three. Oh, the blood we spill for the security of this country. Come on, Franklin. Man, I'll holler at you, homie. All right. Oh, come on. Serious?
Finally, someone who looks like ain't gonna pay with a bounce check. There you go. Now that is a beast right there. Second best selling gun on Sandy Shores. Can you believe that? Ammunition is like the bean machine of the firearms industry. I think that you made the right choice. up here. I've clearly made some very bad decisions. Trevor about? He's probably out somewhere drinking human blood or eating household pets. <laughs> He's not that bad. Really? Well, okay, he is pretty bad. But he's got a sensitive side. Oh, yes, he's very sensitive. When he gets his feelings hurt, he's devastated. So what's your story? I ain't got a story. I'm an independent thinker. Living out here, away from the man. From what I can tell, you're like a high school athlete. Living off old glories. You used to be able to manage heat. And now, you're worried if your loafers are getting scuffed. Any more bullshit comes out of your mouth, you're gonna learn all about my past glories firsthand. You understand? <laughs> Absolutely, sir. That came out wrong, all wrong. Tell Trevor the monthly train is coming through. What monthly train? The monthly train. Where have you two been? Getting some fresh air. Talking of beautiful things. <laughs> yes, I hear Stockholm Syndrome is very nice this time of year. Well, hey, watch your mouth, boy, all right? It's always been a dream of ours. The train of dreams. What the hell are you talking about? I'm talking about gold. Enough to keep Ron in trailers and you in therapy. Enough so that we can pay off that Mexican and get you back in town, oh. baby! Yeah! Oh. This better be <laughs> fucking good! Oh. <coughs> oh. Jesus. Fuck. Ah! Oh. Man, we've talked about this hygiene thing before, bro. I invite you into my home, this is how you repay me? It's like living with a fucking horny skunk. Get a boat and meet me under Rat and Canyon Bridge. I'll be on the earpiece. That's about the size of it! Make it a fast boat! Ah, uh, the logistical mind of Trevor Phillips. So, it's like gold bricks on board, right? Sometimes! This is a high-value courier service run by... <laughs> Merriweather! Oh, Merriweather? Tranquilo, Mike! This ain't a weapons train. Its goods too valuable to insure for air travel train. Gold. Sometimes gold, sometimes artwork, priceless antiquities. Sometimes enough for you, me, Ron, everyone. Fine. Like a mirage in the desert, here's my train. Stop that train! I've got a ticket! Hold up! Mike, oh yeah, another thing for your shopping list. We'll need some bombs. Okay, I'll pick them up when I'm back in the trailer. Back in the trailer? Where are you? We got work to do. Yeah. Whoa, 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 getting changed? What if, what if you turned into?
Conductor on this train? You on the water? Sure, just caught a fish. Let me know when you need me. Got it? Eat it? Be under that fucking bridge. When we go past Toledo Station, whole of Merriweather's gonna be on to us. I'm living the life, my friend. This is quite a spot you pick. Enjoy it now, because it's about to start raining fire. Oh. Yours. The ground 
Carson, Marana! I hope the fish eat your eyes! I forgot to say, nice outfit! And by nice, I mean lame! We got a buzzard on our tail! Burn! You feeling alive? Juice pumping through your glands? My glands are just fine, without the crashing trains, exploding helicopters, and sinking boats. Come on! We need to get on land. Pull her up down the coast. Whoa! Man, you work hard for your living. Boil it down for me. How much you think you make for a senseless killing, huh? A couple nickels? Times are tough. Have been since we put you in the ground. Hey, you had your savings. That I couldn't access because you blew the identities. You know, there was nothing for Brad's defense. Transport taken care of. Ron's dependable, you see. Is in hers, huh? Because of your independent spirit. Hey, 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 hey! Hey, before you go, show me the loot. I... It's perfect. Perfect for fucking what? For squaring things with that Mexican psycho. We give him this, and you end your relationship with that little lady. Maybe we won't be dead men in Los Santos. I don't fucking see that Silicon City again. It'll be too soon. But this is my job, not your call to make. Nah, nah, your job. Fuck things up with the Mexican to begin with. My job, my score, get your own! Wait, you give me that case, I'll give you something bigger. What? Union Depository. Fuck off. Can't be done. I never said impossible. Just very difficult. Virgin suicidal? That a line you're afraid to cross? Come on, T. You remember the dreams? Couple kids pulling jobs, a big one. I know, it sounded crazy back then, huh? But hey, you and me together again. With Lester and Franklin on board. We can do this thing, T. This ain't no dream no more. Nah. Right. You keep the case. Fuck me. Okay, hey! All right. Here. Keep that silly fucking thing. And you can keep Patricia as well, all right? Because I respect that lady and I ain't gonna hold her back. <sighs> Thank you. Just remember, I'm gonna be keeping my eye on you every day. Inch of the way, all right? Of course. And if that bastard fucking cheats on her one more time, mm, I don't know what I'm gonna do. You know, Trevor, we both know you're not the marrying kind. But hey, it's great to be back in business, huh? Let's bring it on. The big one! The big one! Stanley's on the line, too. Hey, Trev. All right. I need your whole crew over at Cape Catfish. We're moving on the chemical weapons plant. Nah, 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 nah. I just gave something to Lester. I need to deal with some stuff, get back to Los Santos. Just, uh, give me a week. We got the equipment with your Polito money. The gangbangers already on the way. The window's open, my friend. 
and you are jumping out of it. Shit. Shit! Los Santos ain't going anywhere, bud. I'm lost. Can you give me a ride home, please? Sure thing. I love hitchhikers. I live out at Catfish View, Mount Gordo, by the lighthouse. It's very isolated. Am I glad you came along? I was out hiking and got lost. I've been trying to flag down a car for over an hour. Why didn't you just call someone to come pick you up? I couldn't get a signal on my cell. And I don't really have anyone to call. Not since Mama passed. She was very hard on me. How I loved her. I have her hair in my backpack. Okay. What? The days get long out at that house all alone. I don't get many visitors anymore. The gardener used to come on Fridays till he got real sick and fell off that cliff. Oh, well, you know how they like to talk. <gasps> but now, it's just me. Living on soup. Soup I make from old soup. Soup after soup after soup. I have to get out of there sometimes and clear my head. Those damn birds always singing no matter how many times I poison them. Bird soup. Soup with bird. Birds with soup. Every night I think I've found peace, but then morning comes and with it another fresh hell. I come up here to escape them and they're still singing, taunting me. No. The house hasn't been the same since Mama passed. Most days, I just work on my project so I can be rich and have all the gentleman callers I want, like a real lady sipping on tea on a porch. You know, I love working with rubber, burning it, tasting it. You've got shoes, you've got feet, am I right? Hello? Clothy cloth ears, are you listening? You've got shoes, you've got feet, am I right? 
Uh, I'm not gonna say you're wrong. But what about shoes that look like feet? Uh, you mean toe shoes? Yes, shoes that look like feet. That's what I just said. Shoes that look like feet. Shoes that look like feet. Feet that have shoes on them that are feet. Because, y you know, you can buy those already. No, you can't, Mr. Silly Pants. How can you buy them already if I haven't made them already? Dummy, dummy, dum dums. I like you. You're silly. The gardener was silly. He got sick. Folk talk. You sure you're okay? Are you okay? Because this is it. Thank you. Here's my number. Will you call me sometime? I get so lonely out here all by myself. I love you. Lester better play it right with that idol. What's going on, ladies? Hello, Trevor. What kept you? Business, Michael, business. Ah. All right? I'm the CEO of a big international corporation. It's very time consuming. Nothing, of course, you'd understand, being a gentleman of leisure. Oh. You know, you know, Franklin, <laughs> if there's one thing that you're gonna learn from being around us, please just... fucking insanity. Then they can't fry you. If you want something done, go to the busy man. This rich fuck is useless. Oh, 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 hold on, man. Could y'all knock this shit off? Oh, Fucker. look! Boys, your boys, it's the feds. Hey, where's the other three? What other three? We told you to bring along six. This is a six-man job. No, you didn't. You, Dave did? No, Dave didn't. You said you'd do it. That is a freaking lie. I do not get things wrong. All right, great. Then we're out of here. Uh, uh, Fuck uh, uh, it. Let's go. You three can do it alone. And die. Fuck you. You do your own dirty work. Hey, I do my dirty work every day, keeping the country safe from scum like you. And you're doing a great job, sir. Hey, you want this job done? Then come with us, huh? Come on. Come on, Mr. Leisure Wear, Mr. Depressed Accountant. Let's go save America. Who the fuck are we saving it from this time? This is the real deal. My sources are convinced there's a plot in international affairs, you know, the agency, and they're using this facility to make a serious nerve toxin. Ah, <laughs> bullshit. Yeah, which they plan in their mind-blowing insanity to let a major terrorist release on a metropolitan area so they can continue to get funding. Nothing increases funding for fighting terrorism more than successful acts of terrorism. <laughs> all, right, so, so, all right, so let me get this straight then. No, 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 there is no getting it straight, that's the point. Now we're doing this! You two are on getaway. Fuck off and make it happen. Michael, you're with us! What size flipper you wear? Yeah. 
Major Norton, been a while since you were in the field. The sight of you in neoprene is something we say for our worst enemies. Shut up, I'll be fine. And you, get in. You're driving. Follow the coast to the south. It's not far. Listen to me, Steve. No wisecracks, got it? No fucking cliches. We're fighting for the freedom of the people today. Don't lecture me on patriotism. You've been living outside the system too long. Social responsibilities, a joke to you. So maybe I redeem myself, get killed in the process, huh? That old bullshit. No one is dying on my watch. Not even the burnout bank robber with temper issues and nothing to live for. A hero's death is too good for you. You'll die in the ignominy you deserve. This is the bay. We can get in through the discharge tunnel. Here goes!
Uh, uh, oh, okay. Huh? We ready? I was born ready. Let's do this. Come on, Dave. What's the plan? Hey, hey, hey. We locate the toxin and action our escape strategy. That's what we got. Great. Lead the way. Bank robber, your job is to keep this covert and non-lethal as long as you can. Dave, you're on point. I'm leading from the rear. Against the wall, quick. What the heck? Defibrillate our friend here, Michael. Let's get moving, people. Hands where I can see him. Drop your piece. Okay. Now hit the elevator. So what exactly does a neurotoxin look like? You're on a need-to-know basis, bank robber. Shut it. Elevator's coming down. Someone's on board. Out, out! <laughs> Collect a swipe card. Now, up. How you feel about this? I feel pretty damn fine. Yeah, if only your camera crew was here. Eyes right. Stay on top of this. We're fine. Move on. You see the lab gigs? I don't want trouble from these two. We gotta keep moving. Corridor goes around to the left. Behind the wall. Security detail about to make a pass. This is them. Take them out or let them go. I dare you. Just a little pinprick. What can a pinprick do? Ask the monkey. Go on. Find your own. Okay, we're clear. Swipe us in. Come on. Lab rat in the cage up ahead should have the secret sauce. Come on. Door now. What's going on? He's got the locking system overridden from in there. Wait, someone's coming. I got this. You, hands up. Back up. Back up. And freeze. We get collateral. You want a bargain? What's nerd face worth? Open up. Stick up, guy. You're expendable. Get the nerve agent. Move it. Move it. This will make me the most dangerous man in the country. I'm also the most shit scared. Oh, man. Thank you, federal government. Damn it! We need to get the nerve agent into a refrigeration unit. Security alert! Security alert! Facility breach! You got the right weapon? This shit's about to get real. Sec detail, there! Let's keep moving! Our crew here! Hey! We gotta go! Another guard! Poor bastard! Left! We need to be gone before the whole place gets shut down! Corridor goes around to the left! Go to hell. Hey, you went for the wrong branch of the government! Here's what I 
ID. I got a nerf fucking agent in my pocket and a battalion of soldiers on my ass. Move it. You're you hit me in the wrong place and we're all fucked. Get the agent in the refrigeration unit. It's over in that container. Come on. Here we go. Get her on ice before the sell by. Okay, steady. Uh, easy does it, Em. Just as I was getting used to having the apocalypse in my pocket. There you go. Apocalypse is on its way. Good. Get this thing ready to move. I'm just a couple clicks out. Is the package ready? Package is ready. Get over here, man. I can't believe they spent the tank from the Polito job on this chopper. It's a flying pig rig. And we need a flying pig rig right now. So the chemical weapon in there, right? If it even is a chemical weapon, hell, it could be shaving cream for all I know. By the way, next time you're getting wet. Oh, but there won't be a next time, will there, Davy? There never is. I'll do my best for you. I always try. Yeah, well, maybe this time we'll get lucky. Maybe this time Steve will succumb to the strains of enhanced interrogation techniques. Interrogate him? Are you insane? They're probably decorating him right now. Hey, Davy, your boys at the agency are on to you, remember? Huh? You and Stevie. Just try and keep your heads down. Yeah, putz. What's this? Oh, fucking A. Yes! What's up, man? My days in the wilderness are over. Lester, he settled up with that crazy Mexican motherfucker. Gave him the artifact. <laughs> now, as long as Trevor handles the wife, we're good. But what about him, man? Yeah, fuck him. He likes the desert. Besides, we do one big score, we're all gonna have to go our own separate ways anyway. Oh, man. I can't wait to get back to that movie studio. <laughs> Yo, all right, man. Well, shit, I'll holler at you later then, all right? What a shit show. I'll tell you what, you could take this desert and stick it. My life may be a world of pain, 
But from here on out, it's going to be cool, comfortable, air-conditioned pain. <laughs> Take it easy. I had a wonderful time, Trevor. But we both know I made a vow to my husband. I know! You have a great pain inside you, but you are a beautiful man. I've never been so happy and so sad in my life. You have a beautiful way with words. <laughs> for, for, some, for some reason, everyone I love abandons me. I am not abandoning you. I am going home. Treat you! I know. I know. No. Stay. You better treat her right, man! I will, amigo! The otherwise... The other ear! Of course! The way I see things, you and me and Michael, we're, we're friends now. Good friends! Such good friends that we will make a great effort to avoid one another. That's fucking perfect. Uh, thank Michael for this statue. It is exquisite. Yeah. Yeah, I will. Lucky miss!
I miss you already. What the F word are you doing here? That's a funny way to greet your cousin. You ain't my G-damn cousin, Trevor. I thought we was family. But please, just go and ruin somebody else's home furnishings. Who the F is that boy? No one, my sweet. Hey, by any chance, did you catch crabs at that conference? <laughs> I heard that those conferences are regular little fuck fest, huh? Guy, come in. Huh? I'd like you to leave mm. right now. Oh yeah, some serious corporate gang banging going on, right? Yeah, with every executive and director of communications from here to Bangalore taking it left, right, and center in the name of team training, right? I mean, now that's what Floyd told me yesterday as he was staring at my uh, my penis. I want you to leave. Look, this is all I've got, all right? I had a tough upbringing. My daddy was not nice to me, okay? Now look, Deborah, I love you and I love you too, Floyd. Why can't we all just be together, huh? You can have Mondays through Thursdays. You can have the weekends, all right? I know that's not normal, but in this crazy, crazy world, is normal so good, huh? Look, Deborah, Floyd, will you marry me? Get out of my condo! And you go too, Floyd! I told you, I've got a career! I don't need this, this, this crap! Yes! There. <laughs> you made me swear. You're crap, Floyd. Crap! <laughs> You're not a man at all. <laughs> Bob's right about you. Oh, who's Bob? I want both of you to go now, you and your weird friends. Whoa, hey, my name is Trevor, sweetheart. I could give a fuck what your fucking name is. I'm not afraid to use this. I'm not. Bob taught me. Fuck Bob. You people are not very fucking nice. Trevor? <laughs> oh. mm, hey there, Wade. Did you meet Deborah? Ooh, interesting lady. Yeah. I should probably go say hi. I wouldn't. Why not? Let's go get in the car, all right? Let's go have the time of our lives. Oh, I know exactly where to take you. I could run in and get Floyd and Deborah. I know she seems kind of uptight, but she can have fun. Mmm, no. I don't think she can, Wade. Just Floyd then? Floyd's gonna meet us there. Boy's trip! Exactly! Oh, Trevor, maybe you got all over yourself. You're all red. You got... you got syrup? Yeah! Syrup. Accident. We've all been there. We sure have, but... But it don't taste like syrup. Don't taste me, all right? I don't like Just nobody. No licking. Okay. Hey, you remember when we met? Sure. Last year. I was on the way to the gathering with Daisy Bell and Kush Chronic and... And you stopped in Sandy Shores to get lit, and you met a dealer, and he looked after you when your friends had abandoned you. That was weird, weren't it? The last time I saw him, it was with you, driving out to the quarry, and then they just disappeared. Poof, right? I mean, they were gone. Some friends, right? And now Cousin Deborah don't want you around? I mean, there's a pattern here. The Congo did get messy. The pattern is you can't rely on anyone, anyone except me. Look, this is it. So this is where Floyd is gonna meet us, a strip club? Oh yeah. That doesn't like him, he's a real homebody. He loves that apartment. Interestingly, you and me, we got a new home. Where? <laughs> here. Right here. Here? Mm. 
Here. Now, I know it's unconventional, but that's the way we roll, homie. Hey, you two. You two, I want you to give this boy a good time for a long time. Hey, gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. Tell me where the manager is for this fine establishment. Through there and take two doors to the right. Mm -hmm. Through there. To the right. Thank you. Amigo! Prepare to meet your new partner. Hey, Lester. Hey, uh, Trevor just called about the, um, the big one, the, the UD. You know anything? Yeah, I told him we could hit it. You down? Of course I'm down. Look, I'll get my research together and meet you at Trevor's. He's taking over the Vanilla Unicorn Gentleman's Club. All right, message Franklin. 